Hello there. It's been like two weeks. But I'm back. So, today I'm going to talk about what I use for cleaning my dentures. It's pretty simple. Pretty basic. But, you know. You know. So we'll start off with denture cup. boo ba doo the lid broke off. I don't really care because I just keep this in a bathroom drawer when they're soaking or whatever. Or if I'm in the shower, I'm soaking them on the counter. So it doesn't matter to me if it has a lid. Right? And usually, like, if we go out of town or something, I won't even bring this. I'll just find a cup. You know, every hotel's going to have cheap plastic cups, metal, or metal cups, glass cups, glasses, I guess that's what you would call them. Yeah. And I'll just use one of those. So I don't really even have a travel one. If I wanted to get a travel one, I would use, like, we bought a while ago, like, big... 28 piece Tupperware thing and it's got some that are like you know that big with the screw on type lid that's what I would probably use but then I have denture brush probably need a new one I've had this for a while now but you know it's made for dentures don't use a regular toothbrush they're too coarse I might scratch them you don't want to do that so and then, then it just comes down to um, cleaning solutions or whatever. Usually what I'll do, um, just got a text and it totally threw me off. Thanks, man. Usually what I'll do, when I'll take a shower, I'll soak them, you know. Every now and then I'll soak them. I mean, I'll soak them when I'm in the shower with a tablet. Overnight, sometimes I'll soak them with a tablet. It's very rare that I do that anymore. Um, or, if I haven't soaked them overnight, because I'm going to be honest, sometimes I'll just take them out. I got a little, little box up here. I got a box, empty cigar box in a box. I'll put them in there. You know, I know some people say you shouldn't leave them out. You should always have them in water if they're not in your mouth. That's what your dentist, denture said. Do it. Don't, don't listen to me. Mine said they don't always have to be in water. So I don't know if materials are different or just if they have different. Everyone has a different idea. So I don't always soak them in water overnight when they're out. I don't sleep. In. So if I didn't use them, leave them in water or soak it overnight, I'll get Dawn dishwashing soap. The blue stuff you know or I think right now I have generic Dawn from Kroger and what I do is take a water bottle right I fill about one third full and then I fill it with water shake it up blah 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 and then on the lid put a little tiny hole in it Put a little tiny hole in it so then I can just and it comes out a little dribbles now that's functional it's not pretty I mean this sits on my bathroom counter because I can't can't set it sideways it all spill out you could also take an empty like liquid soap bottle you know pump kind and do the same thing put it there that way it'll look a little more pleasant but I just do it that way so then yeah what I'll do I'll put some put some water in the sink or a towel down usually I just put some water in the sink because if you drop these in the sink you're gonna you're good break them so better safe than sorry but then yeah I'll be running them underwater pour a little of this in whoop, whoop, whoop. Get the old brush. And I'll scrub the teeth. Now I always make sure I go down or up also. Because that way there are, I mean, there's little crevices. And then rinse them off. Good to go. Now, if I'm soaking them overnight, 
We got a wide variety of options here. Which, if you have dentures, you probably have a wide variety of options also. No one ever just has one thing, it seems like. Whatever. Kroger brand antibacterial tablets. Blah, blah, blah. 15 minutes, it says. Eh. My showers never last that long. Um, and I got a Walmart brand. This says three minutes. You know, same thing. 99.9%. Kills bacteria. But what I've been using lately is a friend of mine sent these to me. Polydent smokers tablets. 99.9. But .9. I think it's a three minute thing also. Oh, okay, 15 minutes. Maybe I don't let them sit in there long enough, but you know, that's the way it goes. But I've been using these just because it says smokers on it. I don't know if that means they're really any better than the others, but psychologically they are. So that's what I use. Um, I like the stain away, stain away crystals. It's like a little bottle that big. I like those. I just haven't bought any recently. I don't know why, because I have 400 freaking tablets sitting here. They have like 40, 90, 100, like 250. There's probably 200 tablets here. So, I really don't need to um, buy anything else for a while. It's going to last me. But yeah, you soak them for 3 minutes, 15 minutes, overnight, or whatever. Um... Then I give them a usually, I don't always do it, but usually I'll give them a good, just a quick over with the brush. I don't use any soap then. I just kind of make sure I get everything off of them. Rinse them off good, put them in. And also what I've noticed that when I'm soaking them, like when I'm in the shower, or if I'm just soaking them real quick, if I'm using a warm, to not hot, but hot water when I put them in almost seems because I have cushion grip in almost seems to mold a little more so it seems to fit a little better I think I've said that before that might be all psychological though so that is about it yeah like when I travel also I forgot I'll bring just, I mean, we never really go anywhere far or long, so I can bring like this, like a six pack of these, so, and that will last me, we're usually only gone maybe, maybe four nights, I think it was the longest we were gone last time, and if you're gone longer, you bring more, one thing about those, they're very handy to transport, you don't have to worry about anything. Now that I look at this brush, I think next weekend or this weekend or next time I go to Walmart or something, I can get a new brush. Just I mean, it's fine. It works. There's still, but if it's like a regular toothbrush, I should switch it every so often. Oh, wait, another thing: don't use regular toothpaste. Same kind of thing using a, a regular toothbrush. It's it's more abrasive. It'll scratch. The surface, potentially, I don't know, but why take that chance? Just use, they make like denture cream cleaning, it's basically denture toothpaste. Use that, because you don't want to scratch these, because then if you scratch them, then there's little cracks, and then like your little bacteria and stuff, just, you're better off not doing that. So, that's about it, guys. I'm done. You guys have a great day. Don't forget to subscribe. Leave me a comment if you got any tips or tricks for cleaning or just in general with dentures. I always like hearing them. I've learned a lot from other people. So, 
it's handy it comes in handy to hear different people so all right i'm done thanks see you later